Hi to all you fellow gamers, it's Delfina here bringing you your midweek bargains in the UK Nintendo Store. This week we're mixing it up with all the games being under £5 and I'm adding a kiddies corner and a couple of really low priced games too. All these games are on sale until between 13th and 19th of August in the UK but as always, check if you live elsewhere, as they are often on sale in other regions. And as always, if you enjoy this video, then like and subscribe below. And so to the first game. Katana Kata Kata is a way to remember or improve combat moves. The aim of the game is to fight through various locations to kill former apprentices of your master to correct his mistakes of the past. You die a lot, but you learn from your mistakes through the Qatar. You use multiple weapons on your missions, and eventually you will find the one that best suits your fighting style. Your skills will grow, and you will build combinations of strikes, parry, and dodging to complete your mission. It is a game that requires you to use not only perfect timing, but the right combination of moves to ultimately win. Next up is Ghost Parade. You are walking home when you become lost in a dark, mysterious forest. Ooh, sounds vaguely familiar. This platform game takes you on a battle to protect the ghostly inhabitants of the forest who are under threat of losing their homes. There are 30 ghosts, each with their own magical powers, who help you along the way. There are beautiful environments to explore and hopefully with a little help from your ghostly friends you'll get home safely. Moving on we have Legend of the Skyfish. This is a level based adventure puzzler game with an unusual weapon, a fishing pole. You play Little Red Hook who travels with the Moon Whale on a journey to defeat the monster called Skyfish. You use your fishing rod as a weapon and a grappling hook and you can upgrade it as you progress through the game. The graphics are hand painted and there are 45 levels full of unique enemies and puzzles. Next we have Quake, a first person shooter that can be played with up to 4 people offline and 8 online. The original game is now HD enhanced for greater enjoyment and there are several modes to be played. Dark Fantasy Campaign Mode, where you play a ranger fighting corrupted knights, ogres and hideous creatures across four dimensions of dungeons, including castles and military bases, and you collect the runes along the way to defeat the ancient evil. There is also a Horde Mode, where you fight an endless horde of enemies with no respite, this looks like a great game to play with friends on those rainy days. My next offering is Cloud Gardens. In this game you harness nature to transfer urban areas which are in decay into beautiful natural wonders. You plant seeds and recycle objects for nature to reclaim. There is a huge amount of plants and objects at your disposal and the only limitation to what you can achieve is your imagination. There are a host of dioramas to choose from, and when you have finished your creation, you can share it with other gardeners. So even if you're not green-fingered in the real world, maybe this is your opportunity to shine. Moving swiftly on, we have another tomorrow. This is a puzzle adventure game, heavy on the puzzle. You wake up in a locked room next to a pool of blood and can't remember who you are or how you got there. You then have to navigate your way out of the room in an aim to find some answers. You get to explore abandoned apartments, airfields, temples and more while solving puzzles and slowly finding the answer to who you are. As you go, you have a camera to take photographs which can be used as clues as you progress. I've actually played this game and shot loads of pics which held clues I hadn't realised would be useful. There are lovely graphics and a hint system to help with the more challenging puzzles. And now for Kitty's Corner. 
My first game is Pillar Builder Puzzle. Build the highest tower in the world and hold it there. Place the main brick on the ground and carefully place the colourful blocks on top. But these are not ordinary blocks, these are differently shaped blocks which have to be carefully placed next to each other to slot in perfectly. Although it seems a simple game, there is a good degree of strategy to keep your tower standing. Next is Cat Quest. This is set in a cat world. Pursue the evil Dracoff who kidnapped your sister. Risk life and limb exploring dungeons for loot and help cats you meet on the way who offer you side quests. Fight enemies with your weapons and magic spells and explore many locations on your quest. This game has a large open world to see so plenty to keep the player busy. Last stop is Worm Run, an endless arcade style game where you move the worm right or left trying to avoid the obstacles in your path. Smash blocks, collect worm body items to gain more length and collect coins to unlock a total of 20 different worms, infinite levels and hours of fun. And my last two games both come in at 89p each for all you bargain hunters out there. First off is Finn and the Ancient Mystery. Finn is tasked with finding the mysteries of the clan and searching out hidden crystal artefacts to protect the world from the ancient destroyer. There are exciting quests to pursue and you will have to work hard to battle through the various levels. You have to fight and use magic to defeat strange and evil enemies, collect treasures, solve puzzles and investigate an array of interesting items strewn along the way. Plenty to entertain you for hours. Next up is Adrenaline Rush Miami Drive. If you've ever fancied being in the middle of a police chase, then this is a game for you. Driving in the wrong direction, crashing and adrenaline pumped speeds are the objective of the game. Do what you must to evade your pursuers, collect coins and smash as many other vehicles as you can along the way. The graphics may not be state of the art, but perhaps it's perfect for those days when you get home after waiting in endless traffic jams and you want revenge. Thanks for staying with me and if you enjoyed the review then like and subscribe. And why not join us in our Discord community? The link is below. If you have a bargain you want to share with us then leave a comment. And remember, take care out there, wherever you are, because life is better when we game together.